Hey guys, my name is Adam from Encounter Wargaming, and today we're going to do an unboxing of doo -doo -doo, the Beyond Red Veil box. So I did manage to get my hands on a first print run with the limited edition figure inside, so we'll check that out. We'll open it up, we'll see what the full um, Corvus Belly unboxing experience is like, and then I'll give you up close uh, shots of the models, um, fully built and ready to go. So, there we go. <laughs> Now the reason that I went for this box is because uh, both Jason and I are really stoked about Infinity, we're trying to grow our forces, we're trying to learn the game because we have promised you guys Infinity videos and we want to deliver on that and so this is the next step to, to help just bring us to the next level, to help push us further into the game and just get us re-excited about it again. So um, let's jump in and really really check out the nitty gritty of these models. Um, I will not build the hack slam models because I want Jason to have the fun of doing that himself. So uh, hopefully he'll build those up for you and, and show you some pictures of those in a bit. And here is the box. Let's go ahead and open it up. Classic Corvus Belly, another box inside a box, inside a box, inside a box. So uh, let's just go over quickly the contents that will be inside that other box there. So we got, um, for hack slam we got one Tarek Mansuri with a Spitfire, um, Assassin Fide with a DA close combo open, which is pretty cool. So I assume this is Tarek, and this is the Assassin right here. Um, and Assassin Rajik with a boarding shotgun, which is probably this dude right here. And for the Yu Ching stuff, we got one Dao Fei with an HMG. Um, we have a Zan Ying Imperial Agent with a Breaker combi rifle. That's just definitely this dude over here. And then a Guilang Skirmisher with a multi sniper rifle. Really excited to see the remakes of the Guilang Skirmishers. I have one of the uh, the, the older ones, and the model's okay, um, but it, you can definitely tell that they've they've stepped up their game on their model creation. So let's uh, let's set this aside. Um, oh right, and uh, and lastly, there's the limited edition figure inside this one, which is a CSU with a breaker rifle. So excited to see um, what this guy can do as well. So and again, we've got the Beyond Red Veil um, because both Jason and I started with Red Veil, and so this adds on to both of our forces um, just perfectly. So. There we go. Let's toss that box aside. Drag this guy over. And, all right, just a pile of pewter minis. That's how I like to see it. Um, so, oh, this assassin dude is so cool. Look at that pose. Like, oop, let me get you some focus. I gotta bring you guys with me on this journey. That's the whole point. All right, focus. Now you're with me. That pose, look how extreme that the legs are. and oh, Just so great. That sword, gonna get some nice effects on that sword going. Um, and also just guys just a quick little note here is they leave these little blue tickets uh, in the little baggies um, so that if there's anything wrong with these guys you just send them a message they have the little ticket in there and they can they can send you a new one so all right let's keep pulling models out um, oh there's the CSU breaker rifle very cool love the pattern inside the jacket definitely gonna have fun with this guy can't wait all right Keep on keeping on. There is my Imperial Agent. Pretty sweet. Is it my Guilang Skirmisher? Yeah, definitely. So I have a, uh, a male one. Here's a female one. And very elegant, like very, very nice, really cool cloak and stuff. This must be Tarek. This model's huge. Love it. Oh, that big dirty sword there. Look at that. So cool. This is big old, what is that, boarding shotgun? Um, a Spitfire? Alright, cool. Very neat. Alright, love it. That huge cloak there. It's being covered by the ticket, but yeah, I'm gonna have some great, great work to do painting that. What's in here? The, uh, oh, this is the hack slam like jump troop, dude. I love the concept of the jump imagery, the way it works. Oh, that helmet is so cool. It's kind of like an Iron Man helmet. And lastly, what do we got? 
Oh, this is the uh, Dao Fei. Cool. Very cool cloak. Love the patterning here. Let me see if I can get that. There we go. Love the patterning here on that. Super neat. Very elegant um, samurai sword esque type sword. It looks like it's a little bit bent, but we can bend that back into shape <coughs> with his HMG. Alright, super cool. A bunch of bases for them. And uh, there we go. All right, so very looking forward, very much looking forward to expanding my Red Veil set. I've already expanded it a bunch, as you guys have seen. Um, so yeah, I guess the next step in all this is to build these figs up. So we'll be back in a moment with them all built. And here is my half of the Beyond Red Veil box all built up. So we have on the left the CSU with breaker rifle just looking pretty slick here I got them all done up on my uh, green stuff world bases so basically I got the uh, the uh, base rollers to give textured bases to all my models and I used the factory roller for these because um, it was the one that most closely matched my uh, my previous Yu Ching stuff <coughs> excuse me so there he is we got the Guilang skirmisher with the um, with the sniper rifle which is super awesome. This model is very dynamic. I love that they uh, they made a Guilang skirmisher that's a female model, which is pretty cool. And uh, here is my Dao Fei with HMG. It's actually a more dynamic model than it looks like on the box. When you uh, when you look at the box art, it just looks super. I don't know. It just doesn't look as dynamic as when you can actually see the front of it. But you can only see the back on the box, so I guess that's part of it. Anyway, super, super awesome model there. And then last but not least, we have uh, the Zan Ying Imperial Agent with his Breaker Combi Rifle. And that's the full contents of the Beyond the Red Veil expansion pack. So, if you guys like this video, you can just go down and hit the subscribe button down below. And if you really like this video, you can help support everything we do here on the channel. You can help us grow our terrain, uh, we can improve the quality of the technology so we can get better video for you guys as well as audio during the games. We want to help, uh, it'll help pay for a studio as well so everything happens through Patreon as little as a dollar video. You can do as much as you like of course um, and you guys get access to free perks such as early videos, exclusively Patreon only videos, um, and uh, sometimes free swag depending on which uh, which level you choose to support us at. So there you have it guys, we'll see you at our next encounter. I like a monkey and a rocket on its way back.